What is going on guys? Brandon over here at Geek Talk. I tried recording a video for Evil Dead Rise and uh, well I did the whole thing and it was vertical. It wasn't horizontal. So I was driving home and at the end of the video I was like, fudge. We're not a minute in. I can't cuss. But I was like, gosh darn it. It's vertical. It's vertical. So I messed up and now here we are again. We're doing another review slash reaction about Evil Dead Rise, man. Let me tell you, this movie, this movie goes, <laughs> when it goes, it goes, dude. I mean, the, the opening scene, we're going to try to avoid spoilers too, but the opening scene, I mean, it's just boom, right in your face. They're not messing around. The one thing I'll say about this movie I think it struggled with was a story, but I'm not going to hold that against it because I feel like the director of this movie just did not care about a good story. And we're a minute in. We can curse now. Holy shit. This movie is balls to the wall, dude. It is gory. It is action packed. And like I was just saying, the first five minutes, the, the opening scene, it is like, all right, we're here, dude. We're, we're, we're This is Evil Dead. It takes like a 10 minute break, maybe not even 10 minutes. And then it probably is 10 minutes but then bam dude they find the book of the dead and it is go time man you know going into this i was expecting something on the level of terrifier 2 because that's what i thought out you know i was told that through other youtubers doing reviews of it it's, it's like you know the gore the, the the goriness the gruesomeness of the uncomfortableness of it, it was like terrifier 2 level i don't know if i'd go that far i still think the 2013 remake of evil dead was a little more uncomfortable for me, you know, with the nail gun and stuff. And they, I feel like some of it was pretty gnarly. The, the, you guys know what I'm talking about. The, ah, dude, it was 2013 Evil Dead is one of my, I, one of my favorite movies. And I know, I know, the Evil Dead fan base is like a, it's, it's like a cult following, dude. They love their Evil Dead, and I'm not there. I really enjoyed 2013. I've watched the the original Evil Dead. I enjoyed it, but I'm not a huge comedy horror kind of guy, so it wasn't really, you know, it didn't really float my boat, I guess. I don't know if the steering wheel, but this movie, man, this movie will get you on the edge of your seat the whole time. And like I said, the story, slacking. Director didn't give a shit. So could you use that or hold that against it? Yeah, I'm sure. But I think they got done what they wanted to get done. This is gore porn. That's what I like to call this stuff. Say hi to Milo. Say hi, Milo. But, it, it, dude, it's it's gore porn, man. That's exactly what this movie is. And they take it to the extreme. Is it as bad as 2013? No. But it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty far, dude. And I, this is one of those movies I was like, do I take my wife to it? I don't know. Do I take my wife to this kind of movie? And I kind of came to the conclusion, no. And I was, I was driving. I was going to Home Depot. I was going to Lowe's looking for a leaf vacuum to clean up my turf. And I, I, I drove by the theater and I was like... Hmm. I wonder what time Evil Dead plays. It was like 12.20 and it was like showtime at 12.50. I was like, I'm going to go do the wife and son are out of town. We're going to go do. I was a little nervous, but it was worth it, man. I liked this movie. I liked it a lot. Now, Terrifier, hard watch for me because I'm not too into the gore porn. Like, Terrifier and Terrifier 2, take it. I mean, it was pretty gnarly stuff. This one, yeah, there was some gruesome stuff about it, but I don't know. It just it hits a little different, I guess. Um, the acting in this film, I'm not going to hold it against it. A lot of children actors, I didn't think they were bad. I didn't think they were great. But the late, the, not the, I don't know. There, I guess there's more like two leads in this one. Kind of like you got the mom that we've seen in the trailer. And then you got, I don't know if we saw it in the trailer. I've only watched one trailer. Mom, spoiler alert, it's her sister. She's in the film. And she's more so the protagonist and the mom, you know what happens to her. She gets the whole blah, 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 evil dead shit. And dude, the, I'm going to call the, the antagonist, the mother. My God. I've seen her in Vikings. She was great in Vikings, but I haven't seen her anything else. I don't know if she's Australian. I don't know if she's from London. I don't know if she does a lot of indie films over there. But I've only seen her in Vikings, and she was great. She was Ragnar Lothbrok's wife, I believe. She was great. But in this film, man, I, she was born for this role. She absolutely killed it. The makeup for her was great, but she was doing stuff with her face and her, her gestures and her movements that was just 
phenomenal, man. She she was born for this role. She was absolutely phenomenal in this movie. I cannot stress it enough. She does a few things just with her mouth. When she goes, it's it's obnoxious, it's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy, and then it's silent. And it's just it's unsettling. She is a very she's a very very unsettling in this role, and I hope we see more of her because I, I, dude, she, she kills it. She is phenomenal, dude. I remember in the first one, hey Pacifico, cheers. I remember in the first or not the first. I don't want to say the first Evil Dead, but the remake in twenty thirteen. How that main actress gave me a lot of the heebie jeebies. You know when she's in the basement, she's looking through the door. And, all this stuff and I, I just the eyes dude something about evil dead they just get it they just get it and i don't know if you're a purist if you're a purist when it comes to evil dead i don't know if you like 2013 i think you're gonna like this movie i think the story of 2013 i think 2013 is definitely better i enjoyed that film more but good lord dude if you're into horror if you're an action pack and action pack if you're in an action packed gore porn kind of you know horror hey this is your movie man this is your movie the effects the makeup uh, insane insane dude edge of your seat intense from 15 minutes in to the rest of the film dude it is intense if you like this film please or if you like this movie please leave a like let me know what you thought about the film in the comments try to avoid spoilers and if you're interested in future content please subscribe like always guys love yourself Try to love everybody. It's getting windy. Deuces!